Good afternoon everyone. Alright, today we've got a 100 series Land Cruiser in. Now this car went to a workshop. Um, I don't know where or who, but it went to a local workshop to have, I believe, crank bearings done or some bottom end work done. Um, since then, the car's ran like crap, barely drives. It went to another workshop who is our customer to diagnose, um, lovely bloke. He got it, uh, us out there to have a brief look because he's just across the road from us. Um, we have an engine mechanical issue. It sounds like crap when it's cranking. Um, and I did believe that we had a crank sensor issue as well because there's a lot of silicon around the sump. So we've done our cam crank waveform and our cam crank signals are actually pretty good. Um, but we're going to do a relative compression check on this blue channel and we're synced to injector number one. So if we crank that now, as you can see, this is a six cylinder vehicle and we are completely dead on one cylinder. All right, so as you can see here, we've zoomed in, here's our initial inrush current, and we've got one, two, three, four, five dead cylinder. One, two, three, four, five dead cylinder. So we're completely no compression on one cylinder. Um, our injector sink didn't work, so I'm gonna to have to fix that so we can figure out what cylinder this is that is completely dead, whether it's, you know, one to six, whatever. Um, but we do have a mechanical issue. So whatever's been done in that motor, this motor is most likely gonna come out and have to get rebuilt now. All right, here's our result, cylinder number two. So initially we injected sink number one, which was firing here, number two firing here. So number two is completely dead. Um, this will be the end of this job for us. We won't be pulling the motor out. It's gonna to have to go, hopefully not to whoever did it initially, but it's gonna to have to go somewhere, get the motor pulled out, quite probably rebuilt, because whatever work they've done has caused no compression on cylinder two. So unfortunate, it's a nice car, um, but someone will have to fix it. So we'll see what happens.